If it's lonely at the top, you're not doing something right. Have you ever felt lonely in your job or in your career or even in your household? One of the most common mistakes that people make is expecting that in order to be on the top, you have to be lonely. Somehow we often think that leaders in any organization or even in our households have to be above everyone else and must be alone. Loneliness isn't a requirement of leadership. It's really just a consequence of selfishness. The me and nobody else mentality can hold you back from achieving any true success in any area of life. You know, if you're a leader and you feel isolated, then you're doing something wrong. Great leaders should be surrounded by people who are helping them get to the top, but who are also excited about coming alongside the leader on their journey. You know, this reminds me of the difference between a travel agent and a tour guide. A travel agent will send you on a journey alone. They're going to give you directions, but really only from a distance. From the safety of their own comfort zones, they're going to try to help you out best they can, but there's really no risk involved and neither is there any true reward. A tour guide, on the other hand, will walk with you step by step. The goal of the tour guide is to lead you on a successful trip and, of course, be there with you all along the way. Their drive is to ensure that you enjoy the ride as well as grow from your experiences. You know, the tour guide's focus is on the journey and the growth from it. The destination itself is also not an end point, but it's a place to start the next journey. Only self-centered leaders travel through life alone or work like travel agents. Good leaders, like tour guides, don't want to be alone. They want to take others with them. They want to enjoy the ride. And they want to have fun watching others around them grow and experience life and success as well. Good leaders are going to stay close to their people in order to sense their needs and also know what their dreams are. These leaders are going to define success as taking all of their people to the top.